guys, um, just a little short update. Um, the last time I talked to you guys, I think I talked to you about a weight loss app known as, um, actually I'm not sure what the name is, but the short term is Gastric Band, and it's by Paul McKenna. Um, I really encourage you to go look, look at it to see kind of how you like it. Um, uh, first off, I'm going to apologize for my very sunburned complexion. Um, we had a pool put in yesterday, and the guy that put it together was not very good. So, um, I was out in the sun for 45 minutes instead of what should have been 10. So... Oh well. Anyway, my dad's getting me some. I'm getting some aloe vera, so that'll feel really, really good. Um. Anyway, back to the application. Uh, it's basically it's kind of like a hypnotic sort of thing that he does. You listen to. I would say a meditative recording each night. It's the same recording, but you hear it every night, and. I gotta tell you, it's been working so far. I think I'm on either day four or day five of the program. And, you know, his, his some of his rules up to now have been like, okay, chew your food 20 times before you swallow it. Um, you know, put the knife and fork down between bites just to really... Um, like, enjoy the flavor of your food, and to give your body time to adjust to each bite that goes in, um, you know, and then things like, don't drink any liquid while you're eating, like, you can drink whatever you want and how, however much you want during the, or sorry, before the meal and after the meal, but not during, because... If you do it during your eating, you're essentially putting more food through the band that you have than you're basically eating more than you need. Um, so if you don't drink while you're eating, you'll get fuller faster, You'll your body will actually know how to give you that signal to, um, to say, hey, okay, we're, we're good, um, you know, and I gotta tell you, you know, you, you do feel a difference, or at least I did, um, because when I'm full, like, I actually know, like, I'm like, oh, I'm comfortable, I'm good, and then I put the rest of it, the rest of whatever it was I was eating into either to-go container or Tupperware, or whatever, it depends on our, what we did that day. Um, it's been really, really helpful. I've lost three pounds so far. Three pounds, and I think two ounces, something like that. Um, and that's just, for me, that's actually quite a bit already. So, I mean, because I've been in a plateau for... Oh, goodness, I've been in a plateau a long time. The only thing that makes it break is it goes up. It will never go down. Uh, so the fact that it actually went down was a big excitement for me. Um, you know, I'm definitely going to keep using it, and luckily you don't. Ha it's not like a service you have to pay for monthly or anything. It's literally an app that you pay six ninety nine for in the app store and you can redo those things as many times as you want because you own them. You know, so it, it works quite a bit. It works very, very well. I also have another um another Paul McKenna app that I'm using. It's called I Can Make You Thin. Which, you know, for me I'm not really you know, if I get thin, fine. If I don't, that's fine, too. My my goal is to get healthy. That's it. Like, 
If I'm still plus size at the end of the day, alright. That's fine. I just want to be healthy. Because there is a big difference. Um, you know, as you guys will know. Uh, so it's just, I'm still getting used to that and doing the programs and stuff like that. I'm, you know, we just, I told you we just got a pool so I can start to really exercise out there. Um, cause I mean, something's going on with my legs. They're still swollen. The feet are still swollen for who knows what reason. The right foot feels like I broke it. Um, you know, and I know what that feels like because I broke the other foot in, like, 2011, and it took forever to heal, but, I mean, this, literally, the heel, just to put any weight on it at all, it hurts so bad, guys. Like, I can't even begin to describe how painful that is. Um, you know, and now, and now the other foot's starting to, to do it, and I'm just like... Oh, gosh, no, I don't want to be on the walker again. Because I do. I own a walker. I own a wheelchair. I have a cane. And, it, you know, friggin' crutches. I just, you know, I've got them because there's different, been different times in my life where I needed them and times when I didn't. Um, you know, I really don't want to go back to those times where I need it. Um... But things are kind of looking like they're going that way. And that personally takes me off. So, you know, I'm going to continue to try to do the best I can. Um, you know, I just, I don't, I don't know what's going to happen or what's going on. And it's just, it's frustrating. Um... You know, I just, I don't think that it's wrong of me to want to be healthy, um, you know, and also to be okay with whatever outcome I get as far as my size is concerned. Like, to me, my size isn't the problem, it's that I'm not healthy. So, I mean, I just, I really want to be the best that I can be for the people around me, um, you know, and just be the, the best person that I can truly be, um, you know, I try not to dwell on that too much because it honestly makes me cry, you know, I'm just, I'm, I'm a pretty emotional individual, um, especially when I get tired or I just sit there and I go, look, I'm doing everything I can, what, you know, what, what am I missing? And, you know, doctors usually point at my weight, so if that's what it is, then I've got to try to lose it because I can't be in this kind of pain all the time. I can't have my feet, you know, going bad on me. You know, I do. I'm still about the po the body positivity and the, you know, being against the shaming of plus size people. I mean, I'm still against all of that because it's all wrong at the end of the day. Um, but I do have to say that, you know, it is kind of, well, I mean, it, it can be very unhealthy to be heavy and not be healthy. Um, I think I just said that in, the, in a double response, but sorry about that. Like I said, I'm tired. Um, you know, I just, I'm going to do what I can to lose this weight, but, you know, I'm also not going to let it make me feel ashamed to walk out the door or, you know, use other means to make the weight come off because none of that is the answer. Um, you know, I just hope that Things will get better in time. Um, you know, I'll definitely let you guys know, but I wanted to let you know that I had, I did have a weight loss. So, you know, it's not, I don't think it's been a week since my last one, but maybe it was. Um, 
I was really happy that, no, in fact, I lost at least three pounds, you know, that's, that's quite a thing for me, that, like, any little loss is a big thing, so I'm really happy about that, and, you know, I want that to kind of be an inspiration to you guys that you can lose this weight and that you can do it, um, I really do urge you guys to check out the Paul McKenna, um, apps that are in the app store, hopefully, those of you with Androids can still access them. If not, you know, hopefully you get like an iPod Touch or something like that that can connect with it because I think it's really beneficial. Like it, it's really, really good. Um, the way that you spell his name is Paul, P A U L, and then McKenna, M C K E. N N A. I think you guys will be very impressed with him, and I wish you a very beautiful day. Until next time, bye.